everyone. Good afternoon. Sorry, it's really bright outside, but we wanted to start outside tonight so that everybody can see how gorgeous it is out here. We, I miss nice, sunny, pretty days. And I'm so ready for them to be here, as I'm sure you guys are too. And Dalton, this that we're getting ready to look at is for a live auction. Which is? Which means you actually get to come here and bid. And Hank's going to be auctioneering. Don's going to be Ooh. auctioneering. There's going to be bid catching. We just have had a lot of online auctions lately. Yeah. People miss this live interaction with the auctioneer. So this is pretty exciting. Um, so we're going to take you on a quick walkthrough of the items we're going to be selling for tomorrow night's sale. It starts at 4 o'clock here in Mattoon. Hey, Carrie, thank you for joining us. We have a long preview to get through. We're going to try to go quick, though. We know you guys are busy. It's a gorgeous afternoon. I'm sure you guys have a lot of things going on. So we're going to go kind of quick. Um, if you guys want to see anything again, see different views of things, by all means, say that in the comment section, and we'll try to answer them to the best of our ability. Dalton is here with me, so we're going to start right here on these items. Look at all this stuff that Hank gets to sell this all tomorrow, starting at 4 o'clock. Also, Dalton, hello, Robin, Rachel. There are, did he say seven wagons? Yes. Seven, seven wagons. wagons in the shed. The shed is all locked up right now, but they'll have them pulled out tomorrow for preview and for the auction. So we're just going to start kind of looking at stuff. Right off the bat, I love this primitive bench. I know everybody sees it and says it's a pile of junk wood, but to me, yeah, see, look at Dalton shake his head, nod his head. I like it. I think it's a cute garden bench. Okay. Power tools. Black and Decker. We have a, I don't know what brand that is. It's a drill. Um, so this stuff all came out of an estate though, and most of it was working when we picked it up. Sander, there's an earthquake tiller down there, car ramps, fencing, ladders. These are portable cabinets, or the, not portable, the, um, the Tupperware cabinets, Rubbermaid cabinets. put together and take apart, yes. right? yep. There's two of those. Another sander. Look at A those big lathe. Check out that metal lathe. Fan. Big. Nice fan. We need that in the office. I feel like this wouldn't work quite right, though. I don't, I don't think so either. I think <laughs> I they like... might want to lift. Oh, there oh. we go. Okay. The cage okay. is not. Okay. Woo! I thought that might, <laughs> we might be a little that. disastrous. Okay, so. We have some trucks. Uh, running boards. Running boards. Do you know what this is? Uh, that is a fan. That is a squirrel cage fan, Dalton. You plug that baby in and it blows. I, okay. We have yep. a grill. Uh-huh. Grilling, See, it's nice I do nice know out. some things. Alice Chalmers with a snow blade on the front of it, or just sitting, sorry, it's just sitting, sitting on the front of it. It's not mounted on the front of it. Tupperware cabinet. I know, Lori, it's a Rubbermaid cabinet, dang it. That's nice woodwork, nice. Adirondack chairs. They're making fun of me, Dalton. Health stools. A saw. Tool cabinet. The kayak. They hid the kayak. That's my kayak. Hi, Wally. Yeah, we'll go back to the lathe in just a second. That is not your kayak, okay? Yep. But they've got it hidden behind an air compressor or air conditioner, but that does sell tomorrow night. Okay, let's go back down here. Wally wants to see the lathe better. And just so everybody knows, Bradley just put all these peanuts out here. I feel like that's a bad plan. It is. I feel like we're going to come in here in the morning and it's going to look like it's snowed out here in the little alleyway because they're going to be blown all over the place. So here's the lathe, Wally. Hi, Linda. Looks nope. like it's an atlas. Um, no. That fan is definitely in the way. Snowing Tupperware. <laughs> there is a better view of the lathe. Okay. Go look down here. It was a bad plan as soon as you said Bradley. Ha ha! He's here somewhere watching this video, I'm sure. He wouldn't participate in making it with us, but he's watching us and critiquing a nice, us. A nice light table if you would like to draw or retrace your drawings. Yes. Good. Metal cabinet. So the best thing about these shelves, Dalton, you know what they are, what it is? The best thing about them? They are on wheels. That is the best thing. How handy is that? Push them around all over the place. This looks like a very heavy table. What is, okay, don't just take it off on a bike. <laughs> Add a test drive in. Uh, 
Okay, Dalton's test driving the bike, everyone. Obviously, it works. Um, the right brakes don't work. Oh, okay. The rear brakes. Okay. So that's a, that's a heads up. Heads up, people. The brakes don't work. Uh, Nick was just out here to tell us that these power tools all work. They're all good. They just came out of a shop. Good chainsaw there. It looks like it's a home light 14 inch. Love the little red wagon and the little red tricycle. Those would go together. As you a would. Good I could pair. see little kids driving those around in their driveway. Mm -hmm. um, nice air compressor. Okay, so I'm not going to lie. Lucas, every time he has come to work with me, has been mouth watering over this little bike so somebody else needs to come buy that so that my son doesn't take it home do you think i can test drive that one too it's a little short dalton i'm just saying lucas is seven years old and he he, he fits just right on it so lawnmower what brand are those troy built that looks like it comes with a bunch Quantum. of accessories what is that one this is a briggs and Motor. Just like this one. Um, this rain barrel has caught a lot of people's eyes. It's in really great shape. Punchy. I was thought about buying one of those. There's like a hundred dollars, hundred and sixty dollars. What I was looking at. Hi, Barbara. Maybe we just need to get it for Lucas. No, Lucas definitely does not need that at all. But he definitely has been. His mouth has been watering over. We have it. the keys to this home safe too. I think so. I think they're in the office. All right. There's a nice little wagon. Like I was saying, all these peanuts that are over here hopefully will survive. Are they all one sale or just So the way Hank will sell, good question, Dalton. The way they will sell these, the way Hank has sold them in the past is he will offer bidder's choice, meaning you buy them or you win the bid and then you get to pick how many bags you want for that amount. So if you only need two and you're the winning bidder, the high bidder, the first go around and you can just take two. Awesome. So you don't have to take all of them if you don't need them. More nice shop tools. These tires are like new. They still have the tread. The tread is really good on them. They're for John Deere, apparently. Yeah, John Deere tires. Nice wood swing. I'm kind of afraid. <laughs> I don't want to sit. Some recycling crates. You know, I saw the very most interesting thing. You can make these into gardens, actually. Standing gardens with their own irrigation system. Seriously? Yeah. I never would have thought of that. That's clever. Yard tools. There's just gobs of stuff. And this is just outside. I don't know how long we've been on this video, but these people are gonna stop watching us, Dalton. We have so much to show them. Well, we have to make it interesting then, Jesse. Okay. I can't do cartwheels. That's what I, said. I can't do cartwheels. How did you know that's what I was going to say? Was to go do cartwheels on the way into the I'm building. in your head. <laughs> oh, lordy. Okay, so now we're going to go inside and take a look. And I'm not kidding when I say it's bursting at the seams with stuff. Look, it's the right tables are door. backed up to the door. It is so full. Is that an air fryer? Yes. Those are super. Everybody loves those. I've never used one but they say that they're wonderful to cook with. Yeah, one of my, my aunts owns one and she loves it. Legos, gobs, look at all the dinosaurs. Oh my goodness. Little kiddos would I just go crazy to, over that box. I don't box. mean to ruin your fun, Jesse, but this is a bat, not a dinosaur. But who puts a bat with a bunch of dinosaurs, okay? I'm sure they're related somehow in an alligator. Look, this is what I was seeing, okay? <laughs> this is a dinosaur. Yes, I know, this is kind of a, <laughs> Whatever, moving on. <laughs> Trains, cookware. Jack Frost nipping at your nose. Mm, does it smell good? Yeah. This one, I, I grabbed this one when I was helping them unpack. This is, what is this? Creamy vanilla glaze. Smell that. Yep. Mmm, smells so good. I love vanilla, it's like my favorite smell. Do you want to look like a professional horse rider? <laughs> Are you suggesting that you that you purchase stuff like that and set it around your apartment just as talking points? Maybe. <laughs> because they can be like, oh, so you were a horse rider, hey? No, I like, <laughs> but <laughs> I can tell you a good place to get cool trophies. So this is a really neat TV light. It doesn't have light bulb in it, so I can't test it for you. 
but it's neat. I got it. What you got down there, Dalton? Oh, it's a cue. Uh, pool cue. Yeah. yeah. Looks like in pretty good condition, too. Uh-huh. All right. Look at so. All we got so much food. Yes. Yeah, so Hank will be outside, Dalton, selling the stuff that we just looked at. And seven wagons of stuff that we can't get to that's in the shed. Excuse me. Then he'll come inside and he'll sell this stuff. Mmm, yummy. You've got me sold already. I love Reese's Cups. Coffee for those Keurig lovers. Lots of coffee. And there is nothing wrong Water. with this food, Dalton. Nothing. It's all, most yeah. of it is all, it's all in date. It's all good food. There's tons of cat food and dog food, too. I see that over there. Mm -hmm. Some blue dog food over there. Yep. You know, go to Walmart Pet and that's treats. really expensive, too. Yeah, and you there's can... nothing wrong with it. So this stuff comes from pallets that have been damaged or mm -hmm. broken boxes or whatever. That's what you're buying is this, this product that's perfectly good. Just the, dam the package was damaged, so they couldn't sell it in the store. And then we have wagons and wagons of garage contents. We have fuel cans. This light, I don't know. I have a thing with antique lights or at least industrial lights. I have no idea why, she but <laughs> I definitely <laughs> like them. And I like that one a lot. There's more of the groceries. I've been dying to get into these all week. The pretzel rods. I, I love pretzel rods, but Me I haven't too. touched them. I'm gonna buy them at the auction. It is so hard, Dalton, to sit in here and work knowing all this snack food and candy is out here. But I behave myself. I don't get into it. Same here. I've just been looking food lately. They missed one of my signs. I had signs on this stuff so everybody knows what, knew what it was selling because we had the sale here on Sunday. All right. A lot of wiring, good fans. There's Nick. Nick, you're still here. Hi. I'm on way out the door. You should come join. A lot of good stuff tomorrow night, though. Tackle or toolbox is full. What is that? It's a belt sander. Belt sander, disc sander. Look at this. Look at this big wrench. I feel like a cartoon plumber with this. <laughs> is that a cast iron skillet? It is a cast iron skillet that does not have any markings underneath of it. Let me see if it wobbles. So, Dalton, do you know how to test an iron skillet for wobbling? Do you know what wobble means? No. It means if you set an iron skillet on a flat surface, which I'm not saying our wagons are the flattest surfaces, <laughs> but kind of. Okay, so then you push on it. I think the handle is 12, 3, 6, and 9. And if you push on it and it wobbles, that means, see, like, see that? That's a wobble. That's not very much of a wobble, but it's wobbling. And that's at 3. So when somebody asks you, does a cast iron skillet have a wobble to it? That's how you test it. Oh. I know, I'm fun. I am full of good information. Well, I'm full packs. of information. <laughs> Maybe not all good. Always good to have a set of those in your car. Yep. Good hand tools on this wagon. Are these all full? Nope. They're in great shape, though. Ooh, I like this wood box. This is a Winchester wood box. Dalton's like rolling his eyes at me. He is yawning at me right now. Sorry. Wow, Dalton. I've been up since seven. That's good for you. Not for a college student. They're not used to that. What is that? Does that have anything in it? Very, it's a toolbox. It's all in such good shape. How come my toolbox at home is so beat up and beat up? Maybe you and these are it. all in such good shape. Seat clamps, wood planes. More good toolboxes. Okay, we're going to the appliances. Oh, yeah, we'll go to the appliances. <clears throat> so we have Fisher and Pickle Smart Load. Those look like newer washers and dryers. Huh. I've never it's seen a, a washer model. like that. Me neither. Nice microwave, side-by-side -side refrigerator, freezer, another microwave. Let's see. These are GE. There is still plastic on the GE thing. So these must not have been used very much. Looks like that's an electric dryer back there. A 
apartment size refrigerator, pizza ovens. Look, Danny and Ron are sitting back there working. And ignoring me. Okay, Dalton. So, <clears throat> hello, Elizabeth. So down here on the north end, mm -hmm. when Don starts his auction ring, he generally starts with these tables first. So if you are interested in the stuff that you're seeing on these tables, it's probably a good idea to be here quick because they will sell. Like this M&M oh, telephone. Like the you can put M&Ms in it. <laughs> That's so cool. Christmas ornaments, totes, nice clean totes. Some Lincoln logs. There are gobs of good vintage kids toys in this sale. Wood blocks, Care Bears, a Light Bright. Still in the box, I bet. Yep, it's all still in there. More toys. A guitar case. Guitar case. Little golden books. Look at all the little golden books. Those are the best books for little kiddos. Train sets, brand new, still in the boxes. Quilts. Look at that quilt. It's very pretty, yellow and blue. It's a newer one, but it's still very pretty. Home decor. Some towels. I bet those smell good too. You can always tell the towels that are going to smell good because they're so folded. Do they not smell good? They, they don't have a they smell. They don't have a smell. So they're good. <laughs> Do you, are you familiar with the sniff test? Jessica Baker is not on here. I'm sure she would educate you about the sniff test. Maybe I'll Hello, Tina. Thank you for joining. We'll see you tomorrow night. Powered scissors. Powered scissors, huh? There's a thing. Ev ev there, everything that you can imagine you will see here, Dalton. Dalton is still newer to the auction game, and he still he still gets surprised by some of the stuff that comes through the door. I guess I'm probably a little used to that. Hi, Barb. Thank you for joining us. Nice art glass. I love this dish. I think it's very pretty. The, the feet on it, the birds on the edges. The chalk horse is very nice. Look at the paperweights. There's art glass. A lot of art glass in this sale, too. Play us a tune, Dalton. Horses, dogs. So I think these tables will sell pretty close to right off the bat, as well as these over here. I'll probably bring these up, too, right away to get them sold. So there, the doors to the building open at noon for you to come in, take a look at things. We're going to get to furniture, but you can come in, measure a bookcase, plug in your, try out your electric scissors over there, Dalton, if you want to see if they work. Um, and I don't care. I think you could watch this video a hundred times and come walk through the building and still not see everything that there is to sell. This is a toilet plunger. <laughs> okay. It has a little screw at the bottom where you can get your hair or whatever. Oh. And it'll push it through. Pushes it through the tubes. Hmm. Nice blankets. Nice material. Just there, this building is full. What you got there? Hatchet? Multi-use hatchet. Ah, I like this basket too and it has more good kids books in it. Okay, so request hour begins at 5.30, meaning if we are not getting to something that you are wanting quickly, you got to get home to take care of kids, to get dinner made, to work on the lawnmower, to mow your yard. I need to go home and mow my yard. Anyway, at 5.30, we start taking requests. We try our best to take care of everybody and get everything up there and get sold. Um, sometimes, sometimes it gets a little jammed up and slow, but we do try to get everything pulled for people that they are interested in. <laughs> this isn't an actual gun either. This is no, like, it is, is a glass. It's probably an Avon. If you push it the wrong way, you're going to have Avon all over you. No, it's empty. Have you ever been doused with Avon? No, I haven't. I, I don't think I can say that. <laughs> oh, it'll happen. Let's see what's in here. Is there anything in here? Presidential coin collection. So it's empty, but if you know someone's running a coin collection, body parts. Somebody was asking me if the body parts were still here. There they are. Medical skeletons for medical education. <laughs> what's, what's that Star Wars thing down there by you? Oh, this is a um, comic book, actually. Okay, that's cool. 
Very nice. It's not. It's very nice. Very nice. Towels. This nice purple lamp. Stoneware bowls. Check out this retro lampshade that I think is so neat. Look, I know what you're looking for, aren't you? Is it Loggenberger? No, it's American nope. Traditions. Ah. So, like, I think Dalton's first job here was cataloging 70 lots of Loggenberger baskets. <laughs> Jesse just went through my pain because we had to <laughs> do something else with them, too. Yes, we've both experienced the Loggenberger baskets. They are coming up on a sale that'll be going online soon, we hope, oh, for some okay. online bidding. What you got, Guitar Hero? The Guitar Hero case with the guitar comes with three games. Are they in there, though? Some people get sneaky and leave the cases, but no discs. One, that is so frustrating. Two, and three. Good. There we go. I do try to check them whenever I see a stack of CDs or DVDs or games on a table because sometimes people bring us the empty boxes and our empty cases and no discs, and that is frustrating. New pillows. I like that black globe. Pull that out of there. I want to see that better. If you guys want to see anything again or see a different view of anything, just say so in the comments and we'll see. I like it. The stand is very neat. Oh, I like it. Very cool. Thank you. A lot of nice art glass pieces. The colors are beautiful. Ruffled edges. While we're here, I'm going to show you the coins and jewelry that's back here. Three brand new Vera Bradley bags, or I guess two bags and a wallet back there. Ooh, I like wallets. Mm -hmm. Coins, proof and mint sets, silver dollars, Ike dollars, and those will all get... <laughs> Hi. I like it. It's nice. I found some sunglasses over there. Very nice. So those will all get sold at the beginning of the sale. We'll mix that in with our front first load of tables. Looks like we have some watches, some jewelry boxes. I really like Moby Dick right here. Wow, that is a cool statue. And his little baby. Mm-hmm. This one scares me though. <laughs> they kind of have a funky, funky look to them. I think they love one another, but I don't know. <laughs> that or they're just attached. See, look at all these DVDs. Did anybody check to see if there's discs in them? I I highly recommend if you come tomorrow during preview or just to the auction that you do check. We do not want to sell you empty cases and make you think there's EVs in them. I just don't know that you might also, have time to check them. Also, whenever you, if you get a cho uh, choice pick, you, all of this That's goes true. as a lot. That's true. You get all the movies That's in the true. box. Yep, you don't have to just take one movie. You can take the whole box. And we'll get charged for one. Right next generation okay so now we're gonna start on furniture which look at all of this furniture nice curio cabinets with the shelves in them deer pelts yeah they have they do have the stuff on the back of them yeah they've I, been mounted I don't think this is a deer nope this doesn't look like well it. I don't know anyway there's a whole rack of them here is the body what does that say? Anatomy torso. $4,500 missing the eyeball and outside of skull. Okay, well, still. I'm sure that's not $4,500, but it's still a neat piece. You know anybody going into anatomy or going into a career that they would benefit from having that? <clears throat> nice wood chairs. This oversized chair looks so comfortable. That has been here for like two weeks and I want to sit in it and try it out so bad, but I haven't had time. So Dalton's going to. Oh, looky there. Is it as comfortable as it looks like it would be? Yeah. Yeah. For the most part. Mm. Keyboard back there. Oh, curio cabinet. Two gorgeous sets of table and chairs. There's kind of the older style. There's the newer modern look. Personally, I like both of them. I'd put either one of them in my house. I like them both. I like the old style. Yeah. That curio cabinet back there matches the older one. So. But you know what matches the new one? <laughs> this is a really up-close view of Dalton there. <laughs> Don't look at me. <laughs> <laughs> the fireplace. Exactly. Very nice. I like it. Ooh. 
How many chairs are with this set? Is there eight? There's eight with this One, set. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And there eight, are yeah. five with, no, six with that set back there. I found a sword. Look at that. Hi, Jim. Thank you for joining us. I found another one. Too. Marbles chairs all just tons of nice furniture i like that striped chair i found another one don't put the sword down jesse you're you gonna know, cut yourself is what's gonna happen i will not <laughs> as all the kids say i was expecting parents. you yesterday at the sale i was totally expecting you because i saw you pulling them out of the sheets i was fully expecting you to drop one or cut yourself with one yesterday i know how to handle a sword okay yeah but your luck is only going to go so far and one of these days you're going to slice your finger nice guitars and I'm if nick was here nick would play us a tune are you going to try to play us a tune <laughs> don actually doesn't know how to play a guitar <laughs> well you're a natural it looks like you just picked it up and went with it yeah Couple nice flat screen TVs, nice glass top tables, little floral sofa or love seat, Some nice wood desks, dressers, more quilts, lots of nice quilts. That looks like my traveling lamp up there. Yes. You should buy it. You should just buy all the lamps, Dalton. I should. Copper boiler. Where's he going? Jesse, what is this used for? So if I had to guess... Because if you say this is to beat kids with, that's interesting. Well, that would be a little cumbersome to be a child with. Um, I don't know. A cane pole for fishing would be my first guess, but it's really long, so I don't know. That sounds like it's loaded. It's a BB gun. Yes, but it sounds like it's loaded. It is. Nice chest of drawers, nice nightstands. This table and chairs is perfect for an apartment or a dorm room. Which one? Dalton, the college student, should know all about it. Yes. This one? Yes. No. No? No, because it's wood and will get broken? Yeah. Or no? Oh, that's. I was thinking size A lot wise. of people also don't use coasters. So it would get ruined quickly. Okay, scratch that. Never mind. Not perfect for a dorm room. <laughs> I like those nice little wood chairs back there. You know what I like, though? What? It's very nice and small. And it's all so clean. The drawers open really easily. Haywood. Wakefield? Haywood Wakefield? Yep. A good name. Solid desk. Plus, I, um, what is this? I knew the name of it, but now I don't. Is it those cabinets again? No, oh. that is the base to this bed. Sleep number. It's a sleep number oh. bed. Box brings a mattress, a little retro dining room table. Another desk. Do you like that desk, Dalton? No. Nope. I don't like the handles on it. You don't like the handles? Yeah, I do like the handles on it. It's not in there. Nothing. Nothing. Nice cabinets. Computer desk. I'm big. I'm good. Just let me Wood office chair. Okay, so we just showed them all the furniture, but we didn't show any of the tables behind us while we were doing the furniture. So here's another quick little glimpse of furniture. I will post this video to our Facebook page and to our website once we finish with it, so you can rewatch it if you've missed or if you want to see, see something hey, again. Do you know what this is? What? I'll give you a, I'll let you guess. Hold on, let's see if I can guess. Are they, they're not Pokemon cards. No. <sighs> Dungeons of Dragons? No, it's actually the box is right here. Oh, they're magic cards, okay. Why did you make, you made me look like <laughs> such an idiot. I have no idea, did you play magic? Do you still play magic? I did play magic, I did. So that was a trick question because, yeah, I have no <laughs> clue. I collected Pokemon cards, okay? I still that have was a my collection. Thing. I still have a I collection. I did not get into all this stuff, but I know that people are. I doubt that we're selling waters. That, that I mean, those we don't belong. are outside, though. We do have a lunch served. Yes, true. There is food here, and you can buy water. Just probably not these off tables. 
which is hats, Tinker Toys, Stadium Seats. Oh, this is completely mm -hmm. cute. Shirley Temple. Mm -hmm. With blocks. Are those Briar Horses? <laughs> Do you know where the Briar Horse mark is on these? Yes, they Maybe. are one. Yeah, I don't think they are. Is that one? Nope. This one's not either. Puzzles, just tons of neat vintage kids books, toys. Oh my gosh, look, I love these little sets. How cute, how cute, cute. All, it's all a box of kids cooking stuff. <laughs> is this what you meant by entertaining, Dalton? <laughs> <Is> this... <laughs> no, <laughs> this is just Dalton. This is not right. what he meant by I'm that. Tired. Oh, kids toys. Okay, what have we missed, ladies and gentlemen? Baseball bats. Knock it out of the park. That's what this cell is going to do. Yeah. Okay, so the doors open at noon tomorrow here at 2601 Lakeland Boulevard in Mattoon, the Bauer Auction Facility. You can come, measure a bookcase, sit in a chair, See if it's what you're looking for. You can leave absentee bids. Did you know that, Dalton? No, I did not. If you cannot come to the auction tomorrow night, you can leave bids with us. So you can say, hey, Amy, Amy will be here tomorrow taking bids. I want to leave $20 on this. Okay, so what we do, what are you doing? You're playing. So <laughs> I want to leave $20 on this, and we will bid on it for you, trying to buy it as cheap as we can up to that $20 mark. It does not mean we started out at $20. It just means we bid up to that for you, trying to buy it as cheap as we can. You can also call us if you can't make it in person. This is and true. We can do that. And you can submit bids on the website. However, there are not pictures of everything that's in here. So you may not find a picture of your item to leave a bid on it. But Okay. You are very welcome, Carrie. Oh, look, we Xbox. will see everyone. An Xbox. An Xbox One. With all the accessories. We will hopefully see everyone tomorrow. Message us on Facebook if you have any questions to give us a call at the office at 217-235-5795. That is a Wii U. I know. Right? Yeah. I That's was... like the newer one. Well, New-ish. Yeah. Newer than the one I have at my house. <laughs> all right, guys. We're going to take off and get back to work. Thank you and see you all tomorrow. Hey. Yeah. You're still being videoed. <laughs>